I'm Harold K. Klim. We are here in Lima, Peru, in a beach called Puerto Viejo, that is south of Lima. And we are here with uh, Proyecto Sofia Mulanovic Kids. We have a training day. Right now we are working with 11 kids all year round. Uh, during the week they go surfing with us uh, twice a, a week, Tuesdays and Thursdays in the afternoons. And then on Wednesday they have a physical training. And then a Saturday, like today, they are with us all day and we can go surfing here south of Lima where the waves are better, less crowded and they have more time to, to practice. Yes, I'm here with my project. It's about uh, coaching some kids here in Peru with my coaches. That, uh, we're all trying to help them become better surfers and yeah, it's good. Yeah, Harold and Coco are great, you know, like um, they are like super important uh, for me, you know, because I still travel a lot, so I'm not here all the time. So they're here all the time, make sure everything's taken care of and um, yeah, you know, when I come back, it, it's great to see the evolution of, of the kids. Sophia is a former world surfing champ and um, yeah, she's also such a passionate person and she's so passionate about her country and the thing with Sophia, she was the first ever world champion in anything in Peru history and because of that, like, she's kind of like a, the queen of sport in many ways and a great ambassador for the country and her setup with the kids, it's, it's great and yeah, it's, it's really, really good to see someone paying it forward like that and yeah, it's, you could, I couldn't think of a better person than Sophia to be that role model for these kids. We had a process of selection. Uh, at first there was like 68 kids and we had to go to 10. So it was a long process of selection in different uh, beach breaks and, and you know, point breaks and by the end, um, yeah, we, we, we had 10, just 10 kids, you know. Um, some of these kids are, you know, are like already had already sponsors, but some of them have never had sponsors or any support. So it's good that too, to mix, to have a mix of everything. There, there are many things to consider, you know, that uh, it's not just surfing, but it's also mental, me mental strength. You know? So there are some kids that are really talented and really good in free surfing, but when it comes down to competition, they get nervous, they get anxious. So we try to work with that. They all have the potential to be professional surfers, as I see it, most of them. And uh, they just have to be focused and trained. We have a lot of, of kids that are really good surfers, also the girls, you know, they, they are looking up to Sophie and they are trying to follow the path. You know? Hopefully we can get one or two into the world tour someday. Yeah, the girls are on it, you know, they are really surfing well and, you know, they're, they're here to train, you know, they, are, they really have a good, you know, like a good attitude and they really want to get better. How